HR Basics is a series of short lessons designed to highlight what you need to know about a particular human resource management topic. In today's HR Basics, we explore Human Resource Information Systems, or HRIS, technology used to assist in the systematic processes that manage people in organizations. A Human Resource Information System is a software solution that's used for data entry, data tracking, and the data management of an organization's people. Put simply, HRIS systems keep track of your employees and information about them. Great HRIS systems run on a database and allow users to enter information and use it without having to know that database structure. There are many acronyms we use for HRIS systems, which is an abbreviation for Human Resource Information Systems. They're also known as HRMS, or Human Resource Management Systems, or my preference HMS, Human Resource Management Systems, HCMS, Human Capital Management Systems, or HRIMS, Human Resource Information Management Systems. I believe the present roles and structure of human resource management have evolved to focus on the strategic contributions of human resource management to the organization. It's like this inverted pyramid. There are three primary roles human resource management plays as seen here. The strategic function is the most important, followed by the operational and administrative role. The evolution has been enabled and supported by the increased use and availability of Strong Human Resource Technology, or HRIS, to help us reduce the burden of that third administrative role. To understand the key role human resource technology plays, you need to understand data, information, and knowledge in organizations. Data is critical to an organization. Data represents the facts of transactions that occur on a daily basis in our HR functions. A transaction should be thought of as an event of a consequence, such as hiring a new employee for a particular position for a specified salary. The organization attempts to capture the data or the facts associated with each of these transitions, such as the date hired, and then store these data for future use. The maintenance of data is central to the smooth operation of every part of the organization. Information, on the other hand, is the interpretation of that data. An interpretation of data always has some goal and context, such as making a hiring decision for a particular department or understanding the performance of an employee to make a promotional decision. Note that sometimes the data itself can be the informative without any additional transaction, such as a salary range of a job. But other times, we must do additional work, like calculating tools or presenting the data in some other order, to turn the data into information that can answer important questions. Knowledge is information that's been given meaning. Where data and information are about the what and the why, knowledge is about the how. We use data and information to form knowledge and to make strategic human resource decisions. In the HR function, data about employees and jobs are the foundation of most of the information that's critical to the knowledge we need to make HR decisions. Best of Breed is about purchasing the best product of its type for a particular functional human resource management need. Organizations often purchase software from different vendors in order to obtain best of breed for each application area. For example, a human resource package from one vendor and an accounting package from another. While enterprise vendors provide integrated application for the entire organization in one system, every module may not be best of breed, because it's difficult to excel in every niche and every product type. Data integrity refers to maintaining and assuring the accuracy and consistency of data. The overall intent of data integrity is to ensure that data is recorded exactly as intended in your HRIS system or database. Data integrity must be ensured through proper system maintenance. The primary objective of maintaining data is to prolong the useful life of your HRIS, and it begins once the new system is put into operation. Garbage in, garbage out. A phrase and concept to remember in HRIS, and one of my favorites. Why? Because the quality or correctness of data you enter into the system will determine the overall quality of the output of that HRIS. Bad data entered into the system will result in failures of reporting, information, and knowledge. There are times when pieces of data will be entered incorrectly into your HRIS. It just happens. 
At the onset, mistakes in data input might seem insignificant and easy to fix, and sometimes they are. However, if not corrected, these data errors could have far-stretching implications aside from just having the wrong name appear on a report. Human resource information systems help organizations efficiently and effectively complete administrative and operational tasks to focus more time and energy on linking human resource strategy with organizational mission and the work of people in the organization. HRIS furthers the strategic focus on present-day human resource management, and it matters to what we do.